over now? <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> so we're gonna condense now. So we're at, we're at six six degrees in the mixing chamber. Mm -hmm. We've got a one k pot temperature and sorb around seven degrees. Mm -hmm. So uh, to condense, uh, what we want to do is we want to cool the one k pot down mm -hmm. uh, to you know below two Kelvin or in the vicinity of two Kelvin, mm -hmm. and uh, take the mixture here and just let it seep down into uh, the dilution unit where the one k pot is and try to liquefy the mixture. So it's, it's a slow process. It'll take a, probably a couple hours or something to finish. Uh, and we, you want to try to, uh, um, the, in terms of getting the 1K pot cool, there's a balance that um, if you have uh, you know, only a little bit of liquid coming in, uh, you can pump on it quite a, quite a bit and get the temperature colder. But the cooling power is not as much. Um, if you have a lot of liquid coming in, that 4, four Kelvin liquid coming in is, is hotter. So the 1K pot went hotter, but there's probably more cooling power. So that's one consideration. Um, so we have to adjust the needle valve on the 1K pot to get some nice cooling power. And then uh, while we're doing that, we can we can adjust the rate of the uh, of this uh, coming down, the, uh, the mixture coming down, slowly that come down. We don't want to put too much down there right, right away because it can't cool it fast enough. But we don't want to put it down so slow. Yeah, we, we don't know, we also don't have this uh, helium, uh, liquid helium trap, right? We, want, we only have this liquid nitrogen right. trap, so it, will, it won't cool down that uh, fast. And uh, that's pretty much it. Yeah. We're getting some good minerals. 130. 130, why is it? When I want to hit the screen, you can see the, the field going down. Oh, sorry. I was, it was going to make yeah, one, <laughs> one fifteen. <laughs> yeah. Oh, here, here's where it's slowing down. I see it's slowing. Yeah. Okay, so I guess we have another hundred minutes. <laughs> oh, let's start. Okay. Okay. So to start the one K pot is pretty simple. You just make sure the pump is going down here, and open this valve, and it'll uh, start pumping. And you can see the temperature will start to go down right away. Now the only issue is that there's nothing coming in here right now. So this is the the motor for the needle valve, which we're not using now. So we're going to have to go over and, and manually adjust this uh, this, need, this needle valve. So maybe uh, Eric can stay over here and he can tell us what the temperature is, and I'll go adjust the needle valve, or you can film what the temperature is. Okay. But you want to see an adjustment of the needle valve over here? I, I can probably see it from here. <laughs> Yeah, so that's opening this 1K hot fill. So that opens that straw, which yeah. goes into the bath. And well, the pump was the pump is pumping on the pot itself. Right. So you have you have a pot here, which here has a big pumping line on it. Yeah. You're pumping on that. Meanwhile, the pot has this straw, which goes into the bath, so and that open. and then there's a little valve that opens the straw, so that sucks uh, in. Okay. Um, and I actually I'm gonna pump this stuff uh, back. It's in here back at the traps. The, the traps got a little bit warm. I think they got very warm. And so what I'll do is, uh, so there's a condenser and a main pumping line, but for, for just liquefying stuff, I just uh, generally want to introduce the mixture through the traps into either one of them. So uh, what I'll do is I'll open up this uh, line down to the condenser. There's, there's already a little bit of uh, stuff down there. And then I'll just uh, equilibrate this side and this side uh, by opening up this valve here. So that goes to the down bro, right? It this valve? Yeah. No, no, no. There, this is a safety valve, so this there's no connection between oh, these two. Okay, right, right. So, so th all this does is connects this this side and, and this here. Uh, 
Right. And then all we have to do is just uh, watch this to make sure it stays cold and uh, introduce a mixture through this uh, through here. And there's a little bit of a leak uh, uh, through this valve right here, which is closed. So this may go up anyway, but um, uh, it will sort of start to open this up. I don't remember exactly, uh, you were what, what pressure you're supposed to keep that under? Is it a, there's some recommendation. Uh, yeah, normally it says uh, G1 should be lower than 200 millibar, so it won't over, it, it won't uh, uh, over cause the 1K pot. over around the 1K pot, yeah. So I'm just opening this needle valve a little bit uh, here. And because there's a leak through this at all times, I may have to close this valve at some time too. But. Mm -hmm. And so eventually, so this, this will go up because the pressure is running through, but it should start to cool uh, due to the 1K pot here. You see the 1K pot temperature is going up as I'm loading it a little bit. So I may want to open the 1K pot a bit more. It usually it, 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 it goes to like 10 or something, right? Or 15 even. Well, it goes to when, 10. When, when you try to condense, you... Does that, uh, does that pressure uh, means... Uh, the pressure is higher means your cooling power is, uh, is, is larger, right? Is that so? What's going to 10 or 15? Uh, not 10 or 15. 10, uh, roughly 10... Uh, it's this even is a mini bar, right? Did this? Oh, that mini bar. Yeah. I'm gonna try to open it a little more. So you right. Hold. You can tell me what happens. Maybe, maybe I can. What's the? Just stop. Now it's going down. Going up, right? Now it's going down. I mean the. It's slow. The, right. We're looking at the. I'm looking at the, the temperature. Is what I'm asking about. Yeah, the temperature. That's going up a little bit. Temperature, yeah, two point three three five. Uh, this. Uh, so I think what I'll do is I'll uh, I'll stop. G three. G three is six. I'm just going to try to do this sort of continually, but if I, just if I stop loading it so much. <coughs> yeah, but, but your G1 is still, uh, it's not that high, right? It's just yeah. 140. So this is, so right now I just have this set of mixture in here. This should just drop as it cools and liquefies. Mm -hmm. main reservoir of the gas over here this is slowly dropping as I'm putting more and more gas over there and I'm it. So eventually this will get below 200 mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I actually don't really watch this much, but you, you tend to use that number. Uh, oh yeah, this is two numbers, right? Yeah. So there's a G3 and a P2. Right. So uh, the P2 is uh, right now 